single leg hip ups. Now you're gonna lay down on your back and instead of doing a single leg hip up where we kick our legs straight up in the air, we're gonna use a little bit more stability through that leg and try not to rely too much um, on that one leg and putting too much pressure into our abdomen. So feet are hips width distance apart, maybe a little bit more narrow. Feet are pretty close to your butt. Now take one leg, the leg that you're not going to work. You're gonna kick it out in front of you just a little bit and kind of just be right on the heel, okay? You can flatten out your foot here, but you'll probably be tempted to use it if you do that. So I just recommend lifting your toe up a little bit. Now, our working leg, 80% of your pressure is gonna be through your heels. Only 20% is forward on the balls of your feet. I like to put my hands on my hips to make sure they're not wiggling around, okay? Press up and slowly lower back down. Keep your butt cheek tight the entire time, okay? Press up and down up and down. Now, when you're doing this exercise, I want you to kegel on the way up, release on the way down. Kegel on the way up, release on the way down. So not only are we getting our butt and our hamstring, but we're getting that pelvic floor engaged at the exact same time. Make sure you do both sides.